welcome back to my video this is the baby and this is my husband since someone wanted to say that I, I he doesn't work or anything like that so he's here yes I deleted your comment because it was not nice lunch break yeah well uh, danishes we got from the food hall Swiss chard. Swiss chard. We rainbow color. Yeah, rainbow color. We usually dehydrate this stuff, and it comes out to like next to nothing. For soups. For soups and stews. Yeah, for the winter. Because this will probably be maybe a quart size jar, if that. What is this stuff called? Uh, um, Pineapple? Pineapple, sorry. We've been up all night with the baby. He has a stomach bug. Eggs, cucumber. What are these? Oranges. We like to take this and juice them in our juicer, which is right up there, and freeze it so we have it for longer. Because when the kids are sick, that's what we like to go to. Vitamin C. Lettuce. Mushrooms, and again, we, we will Soups. Yeah, dehydrate, dehydrate that stuff. Use your caldo. Yeah, caldo. Oh, my husband loves the caldo. Um, scrambled eggs. These things are peas. I think they're peas. I want to say they're peas, but yeah. they look like lima beans when you, when you snap them open. Maybe they are. Here, can you hold this for a second so I can... Sure. lima beans i have no idea this looks like it actually they're, they're the size of my thumb yeah could be dehydrate too yeah more soups for the winter two things of chicken nuggets fresh fruit oh oatmeal the kids love this stuff i can't stand the smell of it because when i worked at days in Oh my gosh, brings back memories. The whole place smelling like maple syrup. We got maple, we got original, two things of apple, I think it's apple cinnamon. Yeah, apple cinnamon, uh, salami. The kids absolutely love this stuff to make like Lunchables with. Uh, spaghetti noodles. Um, Slider buns, the Hawaiian cashew milk, hamburger buns, uh, Jolly Rancher. This makes a gallon. I've never seen this in a tube for a gallon. I've only seen like the single packs. We have corn. We have a wrap. We have five pounds of cheese. Five pounds? Five pounds. Yeah. That's the top news. Yeah, five pounds. And it's actually the real stuff. It's not the... Um, government cheese. <laughs> oh my gosh. He's calling the government cheese the processed cheese. What is it? <laughs> Gluten free bread. Three things of fruit. Yogurt. Smoked ham steaks. We'll usually take this and fry it up for breakfast. Or, I mean, like one of these things we can stretch. By making like potato, as my husband calls it, poor man soup, where you take dehydrated potatoes. Oh, can you can you get one of those um, the potatoes that we did, yeah. the shredded and the cubed? We made fourteen pounds of shredded and diced tomatoes. It's ridiculous how little it made four. Pounds of ground beef, bananas, whole turkey or whole tur chicken, pop tart, uh, cheese snacks. This is what it made. I mean, like this is ridiculous. It's so tiny. How many of these things? It was like like four of these things. And what you have to do is you have to make sure that it's all dry. So you have to wait for a week and shake it. Like two and a half of those. Two and a half, no. Cakes, I think there's like six of these because you only fill them up two thirds of the way full. 
and then these things you fill up the same way and then these things you can actually take one of those meat things and that's all we have the yeah cubed that's all we have that's it we didn't yeah that either that's that's 15 pounds 14 pounds all together it was 14 pounds that's crazy so it's that's crazy how, how many of these jars there's six of these there's six of these <laughs> one and a half pretty much yeah one and a half it's just unreal yeah and it doesn't really take that long is when i did the math there's not that much electricity that comes out of the dehydrator because it's uses as much electricity as my crock pot does. So I forgot where I left off, but pudding cups, Nutella sticks, two things of ramen, might have said to go-go squeeze, I don't know. Shelf stable milk, um, peanut butter, uh, jam, the fruit punch, Two things of milk. I have to save these and hide them from the kids because when <laughs> when when uh, winter comes and we're stuck here at the house because we literally have a huge incline coming into our house, we can't always get out. So I like to try to save these things because they have a really really long expiration. This says. Well, this one says September 22. And again, I can take these things. I can freeze them. Well, take them out of the containers. Put them in plastic containers. And then freeze them. Or even in a bag. I plan on making bone broth with this. Because I don't know why they put wheat in broth. But they do. And there's only two major brands that we can buy. College Inn and um, Swanson that does not have wheat in it. Why? I, again, don't know. It makes no sense to me. Because when I make it, it doesn't have wheat in it. But this is what we got. And if I knew how to edit, I'd be making a lot more videos. Because I would do the day, day in the life of what we eat. Because we eat so many frugal meals. Because I try to gear the meals towards ten dollars or less for a family of nine yeah my husband got a whole bunch of lemons we're planning on dehydrating those things and yes i've got this and it's been sitting here for weeks now can't get to it with the kids and, and cj being sick but i do stock up no i do not hoard i just stock up because if i don't have my brown sugar or my baking powder or baking soda or whatnot, I can't cook. And with the sh food shortages the way they are, we stock up because I swear the best thing for diaper rash is cornstarch. When I don't have cornstarch, I can't make soups, stews, and, and thicken like gravy because that's cheap. And we also have a huge thing of pork chops see I can't I can't get over the price of this stuff five dollars and 48 cents prices have gone mad <laughs> hello hi see this is the stuff we've been working on all that stuff and yes my food dehydrator is on the floor now it was stacked Here's the lemons and limes. And I did dehydrate. Oh my gosh. This was three trays. This is my own. What is this? Um, potato starch. Can you undo this so they can see? That's what it looks like. It looks like rock salt. All these nice
Those are powdered eggs. Oh my gosh, more potatoes. Ground beef. What? What is this? Oh, my breast milk. More potatoes. This is smoke chicken. We have a smoker, so my husband made a whole bunch of this stuff, and we just can it up. This is pork chops. How many pounds was this? It was like three or four pounds. Mm -hmm. That it just it becomes nothing. And I made, I have to make my own like seasoning mixes because again, it has wheat. Why everything has wheat in it, I don't know. But this literally was, what? Two and a half gigantic chicken breasts. They were bigger than my hand. But we made, what was it, lemonade? Mm -hmm. We took six rounds to make a pitcher, two quart pitcher. No, is it two quarts or is it? Yeah, it's two quarts. Yeah, two quarts. And we've got, oh my gosh. And I made, un, not onion, oh my gosh. I, I, I'm sleep deprived with CJ. Um, lemon zest. Lemon zest, thank you. <laughs> Lime zest. And um, lemon rounds, because we're making the limeade. I think the best recipe that we got for limeade is from the Pioneer Woman. But we'll see you guys later.